So far, this is my understanding of the hard determinist position. Everything that ever happens has a cause. Uh, there is no why. Things are just caused uh, or determined or whatever terminology one cares to employ. I don't really have a problem with that, but what I would like to point out is that that's an artificial or potentially artificial narrowing of the parameters of the debate. In a sense, it's altering the question. I ask the question why, and someone, instead of answering the question, says, that's not a valid question. Well, okay, that you can do that if, if that satisfies you. But what I would like to point out is, that is arbitrary. <laughs> you, you're just deliberately setting the stage um, to allow yourself to do that. I'm not saying that it's dishonest, but what I am saying is that it's arbitrary. So, that's one objection. Uh, secondly, um, since everything has a cause, this goes back to, say, the Big Bang, or whatever precipitated the Big Bang, and then eventually um, we end up in uh, something like this. That, too, I don't have a problem with. That's, uh, I think that's an honest answer. However, um, then the subject ends up getting switched. Instead of everything having a cause, we say it doesn't matter after a certain point. That's a value judgment. That is not um, a statement of fact. And not only that, when you say that it doesn't matter after a certain point, i.e. when we go back previous to the Big Bang, um, you then say, you're then essentially saying that um, the Big Bang has a cause, we may never know what it is, but it does have a cause. That is inescapably blind faith. There's no other way to sugarcoat that. It is blind faith. One can say that it doesn't matter anymore after a certain point, and again, that's an arbitrary boundary. Or one can say, we shall never know, but it does have a cause. Neither one works for me. Thank you.